Hello, all creative video editors. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can take poor sounding audio like this and transform it into this, which is higher quality and more professional, just with a few clicks of a button. In this video, I'm super excited to share with you this awesome tool that helps you make sound fast, and it's called Alex Audio Butler. Basically, it's a robot that was developed by Unimule, a small independent company based in the Netherlands, founded by Jerry van der Hulst, working together with people all around the world. This video is sponsored by Alex Audio Butler. Alex Audio Butler is a VSD3 plugin for Adobe Premiere Pro, Blackmagic Design DaVinci Resolve, and Adobe Audition. This is an artificial intelligence sound mixing plugin that automatically finds the best settings for volume compression, and ducking, by listening to your source material. This is a very much time-saving sound plugin. If you don't know how to mix sound, then this plugin is for you. Without any sound mixing idea, you can make a better sound by using this plugin. Alex Audio Butler has many interesting features, such as automatic voice leveling, automatic sound effects leveling, automatic music ducking, and automatic compression and mastering. Now, I'm going to show you how to use Alex Audio Butler in Premiere Pro. So let's go ahead and jump on inside Premiere Pro. Now, we are inside Premiere Pro. Here, I have already got a project. Now, I am mixing all the sounds of this project by using Alex Audio Butler. In this project, I have used some voices, sound effects, and music. Now, let me play back, and you can hear that the sound effects and the music is just way too loud, and you can barely hear the voice. creative video editors in this video i am going to give you a free fire fx pack for music videos it's really very difficult to hear the voice the music is too loud now you can use premiere pro's built-in essential sound panel which allows you to correct each different sound clip and move some sliders but with alex audio butler you can have it all magically be corrected and mixed for you just with a couple of clicks and this is how you install it before you go ahead and open up the audio track mixer, if you do not see this, just make sure you are in the audio workspace. Now, click here, and then click on Audio Plugin Manager. Then, click on Scan for Plugins. You just want to make sure that Alex Audio Butler is checked, so that way it's working. And then, hit OK. Now, you can see that Audio Track 1 has my voice tracks on it. In Audio Track 2, I have the sound effects. And audio track 3, I have the music. So, from the audio track mixer, you can see, audio 1 here. We can also name this, to voice, just to make it easier. From up here, we are just going to select the effects. Drop down and select VSD3, Tools, on a mule, and select Alex Voice Audio Butler. And now, for audio track 2, which is our sound effects. We can also name this, to sound effects just to make it easier, and label that, as sound effects. Then, we're going to select, VSD3, Tools, on a mule, and select, Alex Sound Effects Audio Butler. And, you can see, Audio Track 3, has my music. That's why, I am going to name this, to music, just to make it easier. Then, we're going to select, VSD3, Tools, on a mule, and select, Alex Music Audio Butler. Then from the master, we're going to select VSD3 Tools on a mule and select Alex Master Audio Butler. So now, all of the effects are applied, and here, you will see this little robot status, and generally, it works better if you play it through so that way, Alex Audio Butler can start, analyze the sound, and start to make automatic adjustments for you. Before we go ahead and play it, we have to fix. What's really amazing about this is, that you can click on, any of these effects for voice. Double click, and you can choose, different types of auto volume, and compressions. But, it depends on, what you are going for. And then, for sound effects. You can choose, different levels of volume, and it defaults to 3. And, in auto ducking is off. You can choose, different types of auto ducking. So, I'm going to select, subtle. And then, for the music. 
You can choose different types of the target volume, and also, you can choose to have auto ducking, be medium or subtle, as well. I'm going to choose subtle. There is also contrast, which makes it even more obvious that the music is ducking behind the voice. Just go ahead and choose subtle, and then, for the master, this is where you can actually control the overall compression and the export target. Here, you can choose different types of compression, and also, you can choose different types of export target. So, if this is a digital media for online, you can choose online, but if it is for television or radio, you can choose broadcast. Now we are done. That's why we can go ahead and play it. Alex Audio Butler will automatically make the changes. Hello, all creative video editors. In this video, I am going to give you a free Fire FX pack for music videos and many other videos. You can use them in Premiere Pro, Final Cut Pro, and DaVinci Resolve. Now, I am going to show you how to use Fire FX. This is really great. In this way, you can magically sound mix your next video without having any knowledge of EQ compression or decibels. To make sound great and really impress your audience and your clients, buy this tool and use it properly. It is 100% worth the money to buy to improve your sound and save you tons of time. So, let me know what you think of Alex Audio Butler. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, like the video and leave a comment.